G'day, it's Shane Dowling here from kangarooquartofaustralia.com. Now, an arrest warrant has been issued for my arrest by the New South Wales Supreme Court. I've just published an article on it on uh, 5th of September, uh, giving some of the broad details. Now, the contempt proceeding wasn't instituted by the court, it was instituted by Kerry Stokes Channel 7 and their parent company, Seven West Media. Um, they've been stalking me, in effect, for a, a number of years, running multiple slap lawsuits against me, trying to silence me in, in relation to writing about corruption by Kerry Stokes and Channel 7. Uh, Kerry Stokes has a long history of running those sorts of lawsuits, so I'm not just the only one. Now, if you go to my website, Kangaroo Court of Australia, uh, on the 5th of September, Sunday, I publish an article with those details, giving my side of the story. Um, as it currently stands, I'm in Queensland. I applied to have the matter transferred to Queensland a number of times, they refused, and Channel 7 and Kerry Stokes argued against it being transferred to Queensland as well, which is scandalous. I've been up in Queensland since uh, November 2019, and they could have transferred and transferred it easily. Uh, but when they got the judges in their hip pocket down in New South Wales, uh, they're obviously keen to keep it there, uh, Channel 7, Kerry Stokes, that is. Now, I run a judicial corruption website. I've named you know, 10, 15, 20 judges in the New South Wales Supreme Court accusing them of corruption, given the evidence, some of it's video evidence. Uh, I was never going to get a fair trial in uh, New South Wales. I was actually run out of the state because the court in its, itself made a couple of complaints to the police, frivolous and vexatious, so I, I needed to move out of New South Wales. Uh, but the details are in, in the article on my website, so you can uh, visit the website and uh, get those details yourself.